Okay, hi, uh, welcome to uh, another Digio review. So this will be for the Digio of Reliability, I think. Um, so, one of the weaker of the Digio screens because they've got the more noticeable bits of kibble, but it's fine otherwise. Um, so, got the question of reliability just there, and that is just across those triangles on it. Maybe they kind of rip off the Union Jack in a way, I don't know. You've got like a little bit of a stand here, which is useful for it to like display. Um, we'll just get straight into the transformation. So we know why it has to be feet here. It's only the anime, but I just don't know why they're there. And here we have Submarine One. I think one of the more interesting of the Digimon. This is basically just a Digimon submarine. Although I don't really understand why it has to have feet there. I mean it's from our Zillamon and he has feet, but I just don't understand why. Um kinda like this articulation, I mean these fins can move independently. Well this is back one a tiny bit. The hair pieces. The nozzle can extend to the track just like a harpoon would. And that's basically it. Um, there's no like cockpit here or anything. Well, there's a cockpit here, but it's not like see-through like would be in the show, where Cody would sit in there and uh, fly with him. Yeah, it's more of an interesting design to me. Again, it's hollow on the inside. Um, I'm seeing how I've done it twice before already. There's Samari one, and here is Digmon. So, pretty big differences between the two. This one's a bug, but this one's a submarine. But nonetheless, um, still looks nice. Um, I would recommend it for Digimon Series 2 fans, but otherwise, just it's not really too amazing. is not like Chrome version of this release or anything. If there is, I'll probably bring the decisions if I'm right or wrong. But yeah. I hope you enjoy this and I shall see you next time. Yeah. I always like the way they actually do the eyes on these figures. They always pretty much catch them perfectly when they do in the series. Um, with any of the Digimon figures. So yeah. Um, so that's it. Hope you guys have enjoyed this and I'll catch you next time for my next Digimon figure review. So, so long. Take care.